the fair student funding formula itself has been around for 15 years, since 2007, unchanged. These weights have been around just as long and maybe with minor modifications, not changed at all in 15 years. Does the $10 billion formula, $10 billion, and a huge portion of that is this formula, making changes to this formula, even minor ones, um, cost a significant amount of money. There are no weights for students in temporary housing. There's no, no weights for students in foster care. You know, or so many needs that are not addressed by this formula. We did have these discussions. Our, our, t the team met, we, 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 they asked the hard questions during that meeting. So I, I don't want us to be swayed by public opinion as to what we think we need to do for our school. We go through this process and we do this thing the way that we do it because the public has a right to know what it is we are doing. Uh, Member Azad? I abstain. Member Chacon? Abstain. Member Dillingham? Abstain. Member Salas Ramirez? Abstain. Member Takarante? Abstain. Uh, Vice Chair Shepard? No. All right, so with seven votes yes, one vote no, and five abstentions, the motion fails. I'm very upset that this happened this way. <laughs> this is deeply tr uh, problematic, but the vote has been cast. Um, we, we're going to have to figure out a much better way in which we work together.